This is the 1960 Eldorado Seville. We're going to do a little walk around and then we're going to point out all the little flaws on the body. I'll shut up and just let you look at the car for now. Narration can come later. Okay, let's get a little closer. First, we've got this great little burn through on the hood. Someone got a little overzealous with a buffer. There's a few little check marks on the paint here. A couple little nicks. I'll try to point out all the ones that I can. Down here on the fender. These crests aren't correct. I don't believe the crest actually came into play until this 70s. Uh, neck here, neck there. There's a little paint checking down here on the lower corner on the driver's side. Another neck. Um, a little more buffer burn through here on the trunk. Uh, little crack in the paint here. There's some bubbling here around the fender skirt. No rust popping through and there's nothing visible on the back side, but definitely bubbling. There's a nick there. Small one here on the passenger side. Right there. Again, crest isn't correct. A small nick here. There's some burn through right here. That about completes the paint issues. Um, do a little walk around to the top here. Final top's in good shape, but again, this car is not the correct color combination. It would have been a Lucian gray metallic with a white leather interior and a pink top. Oh, there is a little pitting back here, as you can see. Nothing major, but. Chrome's in good shape. Just one piece of trim. It's on the other side. Forgot to point out. Right here. You can see it's pulled away a little bit and bent. So that's her. Thanks for looking.